Oluwama, how many times have I called you? Eh? Who gave you guts to hold meeting against Ono? Father, the time has come for the people of this kingdom to open their eyes and see that Ono is wicked and unfair. How can he order that no maiden of this kingdom be allowed to marry into other kingdoms while his own daughter is preparing to get married to a young man from Umumbike kingdom? It is not your responsibility. Talk about things that concerns you, my daughter. This should be the first and last hosting of such meetings. All oh, over my daughter. I understand all that you're saying, and you're really right. I know I'm right. And we chill and listen to me. Just keep quiet. But you see, a lot of people before you had talked about all these things, and where did they land? Be careful about how you talk, so that people outside will not hear. Else you will be used as a sacrifice. Oh. Nem, you see me here? I must carry your children. And I must carry your children's children. So don't put me into trouble. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. This is not a, 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 a time. Oh, no work, Anga. A big one. I'm coming on your jeep, Koya Kokwani. No. We all know why we're here. It is about the New Year Festival. But I want to let you people know that Ezewanyi Deke have not said anything in respect to the festival. And we all know now that she stands as our chief priest since the death of our chief priest. And she is the one that will talk to our gods directly on our behalf. Yes. 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 <laughs> 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 I would like to ask you one question. Go ahead. Go ahead. Uh -huh. uh, does it mean we cannot have another chief priest? Um, we cannot impose that responsibility on anyone yet, since the gods are silent about it. And uh, I want to let you know that, as Ideke said, that the anger of the gods will fall upon us if we appoint anyone when it is not time to do so. Your Highness, I would want us to leave that for now and wait on the gods. Please, if anyone has anything to say or suggest, that person is free to do that. If we go to any Oh no, work again. You have you have said it all. Eh? Eh? Look, whenever the gods choose to speak to as a one. Eh? Let us know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Once the gods speak to Ezenwai, Ezenwai will speak to no Wakanga. You see, no, no. You see, Nago. And I will let all of you know. <laughs> oh, no, we are proud of you. Eh? Oh, no, we are proud of you. May the gods be praised. You go on a long and uh, one more thing, please. Anytime you are coming here, I don't want you to come with all these sticks you call guards. I don't want to see them around my uh, compound. Okay. Maybe they are distracting and oh yes. No, consider it done. If we for one, you knock at our man also. Because the little people hear him. That's your line. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Oh no!
my Onowu is, is a wonderful man. He is a very nice man. I am telling you, a kingmaker. Eh? Let me tell you, eh? I have never seen such an Onowu. You know, one thing that baffles me is the way he has the interest of this kingdom at heart. Yes. At any given time. <laughs> Your Highness, you are right. Onowu is a very good man. No yes. doubt about that. He does things in a way that pleases everyone in this kingdom, including the God. Yes! Your Highness, the special services that he renders for free for this kingdom that is. are the ones that we would have paid dearly for if they were to come from another person. Hi! He is a good man. I, I thank the God that you are seeing it. Yes. He is a wonderful man. Oh, yes. Blameless man. Oh, yes. <laughs> a kingmaker. Yes. A strong man. Oh, yes, he is. <laughs> oh, all I'm saying is that the gods of our land will continue to bless him. He said... Yeah? I don't know how to pay him back. No, the gods will help you. I don't know how to <laughs> the pay gods him back. Will do that He's a you. wonderful man. Hi. The gods will help <laughs> All the time, Ono and Ideke. It's either you see Ideke in Ono's house, or you see Ono in Ideke's house, or Gedede. <laughs> why do you want to know why they see each other? Does it concern you? I hate that man. I do not like his behavior for once. <laughs> he is a tyrant and he is using it to subdue this kingdom. <laughs> Though I blame the away, I blame our king for being very weak. Hi! Stop sweating on someone's matter. Why don't you concentrate on yourself? You are talking as if you do not know this man very well. Or have you forgotten who the owner who is? <laughs> Tell me. I have not forgotten. We all know his evil and no one dares him. Or do you want to try? Huh. My dear, please stop discussing anything that has to do with owner who anytime I'm with you. My father warned me to disassociate myself in any matter that does not consign me. Besides, the grass is half ears. Please, I beg in the name of the gods, be cool. Be cool. Yeah. My dear, let me go and help my mother. <laughs> While his own daughter is being prepared to be married into Umubike Kingdom. What is your problem? What is your problem? You are a woman. Watch your tongue. Watch your tongue, Oluwama. Listen, I heard about it. And I know that the only whose daughter is, is going to uh, 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 Umubike to get married. What, what do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? You, what do you want me to do? Obika, do something. Hey. Do something. I beg you, gather all the young men in our land and talk to them. Please, Loma, I beg you, in the name of the gods, go home, sleep, eat, and lay low. Because if Ono, I mean, if Ono can get to hear this, you are in trouble. I refuse to die in silence because of one man who hijacked the power and authority of our kingdom. Hey. Oluoma. Oluoma! Oluoma! How many times did I call you? Remember your father was banned from the palace because of this same issue. Simply because he voiced out that the king is inactive, thereby relinquishing his position to the kingmaker. So what do you want me to do? Obika. Can't you see that things are not going the way they are supposed to go? So what do you want me to do? Let us come together. Let us fight 
faith sacrilege before it becomes a tradition. Obika, think about it. Greetings, Your Highness, and my fellow elders. Uh, this is more of a report, though uh, questions and uh, little suggestions will be entertained. According to the gods, as spoken by Ezenwine, she said that only three masquerades will be allowed to display in this year's New Year Festival. Again, she said, all married men in this kingdom will donate two tubas of yam each, while married women will donate one pao each. Listen very carefully. She said, anyone who fails to donate before the festival will incur the wrath of the gods upon his or herself. The gods have spoken, according to his Oh, no, what can you You have spoken well. You have spoken well. <laughs> Not me, but the gods. Uh, you are representing the gods and the uh, as one here. <laughs> uh, but I would like to ask a question. Go ahead. You know, uh, uh, we would like to know why the gods want us to come with two bars of yam and, uh, and the power. Uh, considering the fact that previously we don't used to do it like that. Mm. Uh, That's a good question. According to as one, because I asked this same question myself and she explained to me. She said the gods demanded it as part of their annual sacrifice and that the remaining will be used to support the festival. We all know that uh, prominent men and women will be coming from uh, other kingdoms to celebrate with us. We equally know that Ezendieze, two of Umwetuka kingdom, will surely come with his entourage. That is you know one thing about you. You know one thing about the uh, you know. He's always having the, the, the interest of this kingdom at heart. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. Oh no. Thank you very much. I, especially the way you explained everything to us. Yes. You have clarified everything. It's not yeah, clear. No. You have clarified everything. Okay? That shows that this year's New Year Festival will be the best among us. All that we have, that I've ever been celebrated. Yes. The greatest. Right. The greatest. Yes. Eh? It will be the greatest. Be the greatest. And with, uh, with one mind, mm. I and my <laughs> cabinet members, we are saying that the gods of our land will continue to bless you with wisdom. One more thing. In addition to what the king has said, uh, I want you to uh, inform the town crier to announce this. Yes. So that nobody would have the excuse of not participating in this great exercise. Yes. Yes. Because it is for the good of this kingdom. It is for the good of the kingdom. <laughs> Carlo, that's a good suggestion and I'll put it in place. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, oh no. Uh, one small thing. It is small. Uh, I want to... Thank you on behalf of the Igwe and the, the Council of Elders eh, to thank the hardest working kingmaker in, in this kingdom yeah. <laughs> and beyond. Eh? Yeah. Oh no, work and guy. Oh, yes. <laughs> no, no, see, no. <laughs> yes. Thank you very much. Eh? May the gods of our land continue to bless and bless and bless you. Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Let him know 
that no one challenges a lion in his den and goes cut free. Abu Madum, Adum ne Abu Ago, Adum Ataifia, Ano Dindo Kanne. Father, what is it? Worry not, my child. Everything is under control. Get me water to drink. Your father is thirsty. of this kingdom. It has not. Father. My daughter. Mother. Stop wondering about what happened. I am certain you know something is wrong in this kingdom, but you are too afraid to say it. Till now, no one can tell what killed our chief priest and why another will not emerge. The meeting of the elders that is supposed to be taking place in the palace is now holding in the Onowu's house. It is time to say no to this sacrilege before it becomes a tradition. Shut up. Shut your mouth. I have warned you severally to be very careful and mind what you say, especially about this kingdom. Honor. Warn your daughter. Warn her because when she will find this thing she's looking for, this trouble she's looking for, don't call me. What have I not told her? I have scolded her, I've beaten her, I've shouted, but she just wouldn't listen. What am I supposed to do? Kill myself? Maybe somebody out there, some people out there are feeding her with all these lies. Yes. My daughter, please, I beg you with the name of the gods, Stop listening to them, please. Please, I beg you. Father, this kingdom is under siege and needs to be delivered. The elders should wake up from their slumber before we are all doomed. Come in, come on. My father used to say 
No matter how long a blind man stares at the sky, he cannot see the sun. But that a blind man cannot see the sun does not mean the sun is not up there at the sky. <laughs> the vultures do not gather when death do not call for feast. The time has come for we all to stand together, open our ears and hear with it. Open our eyes and see what has been hidden away from us all this while. Ono Wu, the Ono Wu has made his order that no maiden of this kingdom will be married to another kingdom. Why his own daughter will soon get married to a man from Umumbike kingdom? Something has to be done before the hand of a monkey turns into that of a human being. But the question is, what do we do? Um, Obika, what do you want us to do now? Give it your time. Young men of this great kingdom, I want us to stand together, quench this fire. I want us to stand together and quench this sacrilege before it becomes a custom of this land. Something has to be done. Um, Bobika, listen, I am not in support of this. Genti Kangwagi. If we need an old Buddha, Moses, Manun, Mabel, Mokuko, Han Chana, what you know with Han Chana, no chief, I suggest you should go home and don't talk about this again. Oh, no. As you all can see, we are helpless and marginalized. But you cannot do anything. According to my father, the thunder and lightning which we all witnessed yesterday has never happened in this kingdom. And that sign is not a good sign. But I believed in one thing. You got BK? If we all can join hands together and fight this woman. I'm sure we must achieve something positive. <laughs> you are a true son of your father. <laughs> Maybe you will live long. Say. You all know my sisters. And you all know they are the most beautiful in this kingdom. Yet they are getting old in my father's house. All because of Onowu's orders. Because he has given an order, no maiden should get married to someone who is not from this kingdom. But his daughter, she is getting married soon from someone who is not of this kingdom. DK, that is why I summoned this meeting. That is why I summoned this meeting. So that we can join heads together. Fight this. Because if we do not do anything about this, even our offspring will suffer perish and anguish and pain for eternity. So, something has to be done. I have told you people. I come here, you are my children, you know me. Greetings, your highness. How are you? Very well. <laughs> I, I know you are going to your nose place. Exactly. Uh, but, but why are you carrying these items yourself? You're supposed to send the guards to carry them for you. Yes. Why are you asking stupid questions? Hey. Why are you saying stupid things? Were you not there that they want to know who told me that he would not allow me to be coming to his house with uh, my guards? Were you not there? I'm, I'm sorry, Your Highness. <laughs> you have a point. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Now listen to me. I want to go and do my. I want to go and set an example so that everybody in this kingdom will do his work. Okay? Because Onohu is a very dedicated man, oh, yes. wise man. <laughs> whatever he says, whatever he says, there must be a reason for it. Oh yes, there's so much wisdom. Yes. Your okay. Highness, it will interest you to know that I have done mine already. Good. Yes. Very <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> thank you. Well, I'm proud of you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Yes. 
Eh? Oh no, work again. Oh, well, you have Let me it. just go ahead. <laughs> It is obvious that the king is under a spell, including his cabinet chiefs. Instead of sending his guards to deliver those items, he went there by himself. Hello, Ama. Something has to be done. Something has to be done to liberate this kingdom. Something has to be done to deliver this kingdom from the shells of darkness. Well, <clears throat> as for what you and I discussed the last time we met, I summoned some of the young men of this kingdom yesterday. So after I'm discussing with them, some stayed back why some left? Do not relent. Even when they all leave. I believe that the gods will use us to deliver this kingdom. How can we do this by ourselves? I shall summon the maidens again and convince them. Okay? I shall be going home from here. May the gods strengthen you more. I like her. I like this man. <laughs> Mdokako! Who is there? Who is in there? Who is looking for my parents? Oh no, who is looking for your parents? Is anything the matter? To collect the two bars of William and Paul agreed by every man in this kingdom to be donated before the New Year festival. They did not give me such instruction before leaving the house. Mm. And even if they did, I will not give you any other item. I will not! What? You will not do what? Get her. You can't get me! I will not give you anything! Make sure you get her! Make sure you get that idiot! Oh no! Hey! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh You asked your daughter to insult me! How you ask her to insult me! Oh no, how can I? Me, you know what? No, 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 no. No, no. Wait, 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 where is the power? And the two bars of it? Where is it? Let's get them. Okay. Okay. Where is she? Where is she? She escaped. She escaped. She escaped. Is that what you're telling me? Yeah. 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 Listen. If your daughter comes back, bring her to my house, or she will face the wrath of Ono Wakanda. You see, no, no, you see, Nago. Now hand over that. Hand it over there. Aiga. Aba Sioso. Oluoma. Father. Oluoma, why are you bent on destroying all of us? Eh? Why? Do you know the implication of what you have done against Ono? Father, I did not do anything to him. I am only fighting for our freedom. Oluoma, mom. My daughter. Why don't you stop all these things you are doing? Look, one day this thing will cost you your life, oh. Okay. Mother, I am sorry to disappoint you. I have started this fight already, and there is no going back. Can you listen to your daughter? Can you listen to your daughter's foolishness? I will not warn you again. I will not. Oh, go ahead. Keep on. Keep on with the fight, till one day you will look for your head, and it is no longer on your neck. Will you go to the and apologize to him? Go away. But I am not going anywhere. And there's nothing you will go to the house.
Who is that? Huh? Who is calling Okanja? Ikega! Huh? Wherever it is, be very careful. Be careful! lightning and thunder strikes. Again, I've been having series of bad dreams. The last one I had was uh, Oloma, the daughter of Ondoka, who wanted to stab me. And I woke. <laughs> oh no. As a Calm down. Everything is under my control. You have nothing to worry about. Hmm. As for that maiden, if you see her again in your dream, just let me know. You see, no, no. You see, Nago. Eh? We shall continue to rule this kingdom. Bam. Onye ekwetoro and ekwetere. Oh no. Aloma, please go back home. Hmm? Go back home. When I need you, I will send for you. Yes, go back home. Everything is under control. There's no problem. Just go. I will send for you when I need you. Father, I thought you said she was coming to apologize for the insult she gave me, and you just asked her to leave. Why, Father? Will you get inside? Get inside! The reason I summoned all of you again is to hear your response concerning the discussion we had in our last meeting. What do you say? I am no longer waiting for anybody to talk to me again. Yes, though my mother warned me severely to stay clear from any gathering or discussion that has to do with Ono. Or about the reign of this kingdom. <laughs> but in as much as that, Oloma, I am solidly behind you. Gabana Ogenna. Thank you. But as for your mother, I will see her later and have a talk with her. I'm sorry, Oloma. 
I'm not against you in any way at all. But I cannot risk my poor life for this cause at all. Even my father has warned me severally to stop and separate myself from this gathering. So, oh ma, your father is only afraid of what the Ono will do to him. But one day, the truth shall come to light, and his eyes shall be opened. As for me, I'm in support of the whole thing. But I cannot join the movement because many have died trying to stop the same atrocities. You do not have to be afraid. Be bold! I am just confused. I, I mean, I, I am just confused about this whole thing. If you are confused, then you still do not understand. After the meeting, I will explain to you further. Okay? Please, I will appreciate that. You all need to support me. Stand with me. So we can bring the light that will shine upon us and our generations to come. Um. Iba ino ga drama. No, no. Ni ma se no na ba no gba ajo so. Agba ire ajo e bu. This is okay. He is now our new chief priest. Oh. Yeah. That is very good. That's good. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> um oh no. Where is he from? What? If you want to incur the wrath of the gods, go ahead. But it will only be on your head, your children, and your generation. You did not see me. You did not see me. I'm sorry. Oh no, please, don't be, a, don't be, a, don't, don't be offended. There is no need to ask such questions. Ah! The most important thing is to make sure that he can con always consult the gods. On our behalf. Every time. Oh, That's the most important thing. And uh, when are we going to present him to the entire kingdom? For no work. See no. See now. I will meet with Ezemai on this issue and communicate with you. I thought you know he's a bad man, but I have every reason now to believe he's a good man. Oh, say, the Onowu is a very good man. Hmm. See, he has never compromised his position as a kingmaker in this land. That's true. That's true. And from all indications, he is likely to be the next king after the death of Waki. Say it again. Say it again. The gods will bless him for his good works in this kingdom. Oh, yes. He said, they will keep strengthening him to do more. Oh. He's a very good man. I never knew he's this good. I know he is. He is. Ah, I've known this a long time ago. I am making progress in convincing my fellow maidens. We met yesterday, and most of them now understand the point I am driving at and are ready to swing into action with me. Hmm. Interesting. That, that is a nice one. That is nice. Uh, well, I will meet with my fellow young men to make sure that everything is in place accordingly. Very important. Oloma, I heard that the Onu who brought in an unknown man from another kingdom to become the chief priest of our land. The worst part of it is that the king and his um, cabinet chief did nothing about it. They accepted it in good faith and, and without any objection. They did nothing about it. That is to show you that our kingdom is near due. But we will not allow it to happen. That is why we need to stand firm.
Who are you? Why are you standing on my way? And what do you want from me? I've come to warn you. Withdraw from your dirty activities or you face the wrath of the gods. The little bird growing wings can never ever grow bigger than me. The mad beast of the gods. Now, get out of my way. I have an important message to deliver to Ezewan. Prudence is danger and hides. But the foolish goes and suffers it. The ground you are treading on is too hot for mere mortals like you. Take up those things you are wearing and go back to your kingdom. Young maiden, who gave you the gods to stand before me? Do you want the virtues? Eat from your flesh. I will only spare you today because of where I'm rushing to now. Get out from my way. It's only the foolish bird that will be burning in fire and yet still boast of dropping corn. I warn you for the very last time. Go back to your kingdom. Hmm. Okay, we're going to go to the house. 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 Okay, we're going to talk to our priestess like that. The great as a wine. She is a priestess of peace, love and harmony. She is merciful. And if you don't live here now, you will regret coming to meet us. I will send a message across to her. If you don't live here now, I will... Yes, it's the one. Oh. Who is she? And where does she come from? It's the one. We have to sit up. We have to do something very fast. If not, there may be consequences. Because it's the one. Do not be afraid. I, as the one, the great priestess of Adu knows what to do. I am not shaking. Neither am I afraid of the rat that has come to wrestle with the elephant. Mbano! Otwara Baron Mweku! 
Oh no! Go home and have some rest. I will get her now. That's why you take it. Where is the person? But I heard the voice. So where is the person? No, is it I heard someone call father. Hello? Maybe. Maybe. Let's move this way. What is it? Mother, we are afraid. Afraid of what? We are at the backyard. When we heard someone scream your name. We came out here. We didn't see anybody. Huh? The same voice repeated at the backyard. Huh? And when we got there, the stage now. We didn't see anybody. So we ran into the hut. Get inside. Huh? Get inside! no longer a secret that there is no priest in this kingdom. The chief priest and Ideke's mate all died in one day. Just one day, your highness. Yes, it has never happened like this in this kingdom, your highness. For the chief priest to die like a vow. Yes. We have to find a solution to this problem and we must do it fast. What do we do? Eh? Yes, what do we do? We came to inquire from you and you are asking us. What do we do? You came to inquire from me? Yes, your highness. Unu be alayju tam. Inye le me buo. Unu be alayju tam. Ha! It's quite unfortunate and disheartening that it seems like you don't know that a kingmaker is greater than the king. Eh? No energy is the kalileze. Then let's go and inquire from from Olo. For your highness, you cannot afford to be a stranger in your kingdom. Are you not aware that your know is nowhere to be found? Yes! Uh, oh no! Yes! Hey! It's nowhere to be found! Yes! You are the lot! You are the lot! And you know who is nowhere to be found? Yes! And both of you are here! What are you doing here? We don't live in a cookie! Oh no! We don't live in a cookie! Hey! Yes! You are the lot! You are the lot! You are the lot! Hey! You are the lot! 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 I 
Daughters, who is after you? What, what's happening? Greetings. I heard that Holoman of Mika at the village square. They want to kill them. Who? He take the princess is there. We don't know. Hi. Nani. Nani Kapu. Nani Piko, you need to go safe. She's our only child, our only daughter. Nani. You go. You can't even change Nani. Nani, your only child. Nani Piko, Siano, you need to save her. Please, she's our only child. But I want her separately. So is that why we, we, we will not go and help her? I should go. Yes, yes. Nani Biko. Anna, Anna, do you want Nani, I'm pushing her. Jackie, the make it no. You say she's where with who? No. The old one, the princess. Hey, my only child. She left. Then Nani can't even waste time. You say I should go. Yes. Oh no, who may join me and kill me together with him? He will not kill you. Nani will not kill you. Biko. Okay, I'm going. Go, please, Nani, go. Where do you say that? I, I the village square. The village square. Let this serve as a warning to all of us. I keep telling people that the physical combat between the leopard and the chimpanzee is never a threat to the kingship of the lion. Yes. It's never a threat! Both of you committed heinous crime and must be slaughtered according to the custom of this great kingdom. No. Oh, 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 no, please. I beg you, Biko. In the name of the gods, I beg you. Ha. I am pleading. I will never do it again, I swear. I oh, Biko! Let me go. Oh, what? Why are you begging him? Hey, because I don't want to die. I don't want to. I cannot beg anyone. Okay. I will not beg you. Both of you have destroyed the peace of this kingdom. And no one is saying or doing anything about it. Shut up, Mechigono. I will not. You elders are afraid of him. Even our king is under his spell. If everyone is afraid of you because of your evil practice, I, Oloma, will not be afraid of you. So go ahead and kill me. Go ahead and kill me! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Spare my daughter, please. She is just a maiden that does not know anything. Please don't kill her because of me. Father, why are you begging him? Shut up! Shut it for once! Oh no, please don't mind anything she's saying. Please, for my sake, don't kill her. Shut up, Nduka, and listen to me. The lizard that stopped his father's corpse from being buried will carry the corpse on its head. Your daughter has taken more than her mouth can contain. Therefore, she must die. She must die! Go ahead and kill me. What are you waiting for? But bear in mind that the gods of this land are not asleep. And they know that we are fighting a just cause to liberate our people from your evil practice. That is why you want us killed. Go ahead. Kill me. Kill us. Look on his horse. Don't stop the insane horse. You have the gods to talk in my presence. Hmm. I see you are proud of the crime you committed. You will face the penalty now. Behead them! Who is this little idiot? Who are you? Serve me her head! You little 
to which? Who are you? And where do you come from? You don't have to know. Set these people free. You lied. The grasshopper that is dancing in the territory of birds did not know that the ground is dangerous for him. If you do not live here now, I will destroy you like I did in the likes of you in the past. The size of a bird cannot determine its strength to fly. The body hears it the most when the ears are blocked. Hum! Oragute! Otsubabala! There was a big war at the village square between a deke and an unknown maiden that appeared when they wanted to slaughter Oloma, our daughter, and Obika. She distracted their plans. She killed uh, the young men that would have killed Oloma and Obika with their machet. May the gods be praised. So, where is our daughter now? Oloma. I, I can't tell where she is, but um, there was confusion. We all ran helter skelter. But it was very obvious she was there for our daughter. So wherever our daughter is, she will be safe. Are you sure she's safe? I am sure. I am sure. Nani, you had better be sure. You had better be sure. Oko Fumamadiji, my only child. Come on, even now, Wagi. Umar if gave me nothing will happen to her. She will be fine. Huh. She's safe. Let us go in. Nani, I I'm going in. Maybe I should go and look. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, uh, believe what I have told you. But you didn't want to go in the first place. What am I supposed to be? What happened here, Nienu? What are you I'm 
Hai! Mungkin aku kulung golong-golong mai sinaga. Mas aku salio guma gana. Iku sagu ya. The battle line is drawn. Whosoever you are. Oh mo bakala mo bakala mo. O bo nyam bosendo na ti auto. The time is now. The battle line. This is how you two would have died. Hey! Thanks to the gods for saving your lives. What if I may ask, where does that maiden come from? Eh? That is a very big question. The point is that we don't know anything about her. We don't know where she came from. Yes. And where could she be now? We cannot tell. For she only told us to stand on the truth. And nothing will happen to us. <laughs> this is wonderful. I did. <sighs> Thanks to the gods once again for saving your lives. At least those that were against this movement initially will now see that actually the gods are in support of this cause. <laughs> yes! Sadly. That's true. But all I know is that the battle line is drawn between Ideke and the young maiden. But there is something I noticed earlier today. The maiden is powerful. Hmm. She challenged them to a standstill. Hmm. <laughs> well, all I will urge every one of us is that let us go to our respective homes and leave the girls to finish their fight. Please. Go back to your kingdom and confess. Else you die. Pa! What have you got with your Ha! Obola to Libya. Obola to Libya. Ha! Obola to Libya. Him! I will close my eyes. But before I open them, you are gone forever. You lie. The choice is yours. It's either you leave or you die. Hum! Ha 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 ha! Oh, click click click! I'm Ha! This is going to be a good one. Osadabo, hey, um, hum. Oh, 
What is it? Uh, uh, I can't remember inviting you to my house. <coughs> that is trouble. What trouble? <laughs> oh no. Where is your wife? How dare you ask me such question? Who are you to ask me that? I ask again. Where is your wife? She's dead. She's dead. You, go and bring the biggest black she goats. If you move anywhere, I'll cut off. One from you. I said go. Go and do what's good. have done your own. Now leave the rest for the God. Did you hear what happened today at the Nui's house? No. The Nui's wife was restored to human by the strange lady. That same maiden? Yes! <laughs> How did she do that? The know who had earlier turned his wife into a goat and announced that she was killed by a wild animal in the forest where she oh. went to fetch fire. Not knowing that she was one of the she-goats in his house before the strange meeting arrived. Hi. Ah, wickedness. Hi. That man is crafty. He is heartless and evil. Hi. So, he turned his wife into a goat 
and made the whole kingdom believe that she was devoured in the bush according to the great thing. <laughs> Hi! There is one question that turns my stomach. Can you please tell me what could be his reasons for turning his own wife to a goat? The same woman who paid a dowry. I don't understand this man. Is that what you meant for any of us here? Eh? Because you know who is not here. Well, all I'm after is. Whatever goes up, he will surely come down. Definitely. He will pay for his deeds. He has been exposed. <laughs> I'll see you all later. It's alright. Oh, no. <laughs> you are nice. You may not believe this, but it's the truth I am telling you. Before our very eyes, we saw a goat turned into Onohu's wife. Mm. But earlier on he told us that his wife was missing in the forest. So how, how do we reconcile this? Um, now listen to me. I don't want us to start talking about Onohu. Yes, because we've not had uh, his own side of the story. What made him turn his wife into a goat? I don't even know whether he did. Okay? So let's not talk. And one thing I want to advise is this. Everybody should go home and stop talking about Uno. Until everything unfold. Okay? Because definitely everything will unfold. But they should tell that little goddess to leave this kingdom. She must leave this kingdom before Uno will deal with her. Uh, she has, because she does not. Maybe. She does not know who the owner who is, uh, but she will soon find out. Okay, chop them. Uh, if I have my way, I'll, I will tell her to leave this kingdom. Beautiful! Now you are saying something reasonable. Tell her to leave this kingdom by all means. What kind of problem is this? Get on this over here! Mario Yalabia no 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 She must leave this kingdom. Heard about how the goat in Onowo's house was turned back into Onowo's wife. But listen to me. Don't discuss this anywhere in the kingdom. Don't. You know no is dangerous. Father, he cannot do anything. He cannot. Not even now that the strange maiden has exposed him. Shut up. Shut your mouth, Uchikelono. Eh? Now listen, go inside. Carry your food and go and eat. I am not hungry. Okay, the young maiden is dealing with him. Let her continue to deal with him while you mind your business. One, oh, has, no, oh, 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 what going on? one has seriously. Father, you are too afraid. You are too afraid. You are too afraid. I will stop talking. He cannot do anything. He cannot. He won't do anything to me. Eh? He will not. Hey. 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 Father, you're not talking. Say something. Only the gods will reward you for all your evil things. Evil man. Let's go. Let's go. You're so wicked. I hate you. Where's the one? Where's the one? Where's the one you did?
Does it mean that BK is dead? For some days now, I have not set my eyes on her. If truly she is dead, that means my own is finished. My children and the people of this kingdom are beginning to know what we have secretly against this kingdom. I have to do something since I cannot kill that lady. Get out of my way, you little witch. If you do not get out of my way now, I will destroy you and bring you down to dust. You ordinary mortal. You dare threaten me? <laughs> Omo abo no work anga. Isi no no. Isi na go. Mata ju ogu ko ngun ojo. Ngbaburia. Give me. Please, Doc. Please. Stand up. And move. Please. I don't want to face any shame. Just mention how many parcels of land you want. I'll give it to you. Quiet! Move! Oh, ah. Who is doing this? Okay. Yeah. Why should oh, no we sit on the ground? This is abomination. Ah. Hey. The king maker sitting on the ground. Hello, ah. man. This man kept you all under his nose. You have been living under his shadow. Remove me out of here, or I will kill everyone here. Shut up! You lie. The people of this kingdom are innocent. So go back to where they brought you from. It is not possible. So no one, Ideke, brought that deity to control the affairs of this kingdom. 
They killed as a mob and then made the elders mad. The elders that refused to support their evil ideas. You fool! Uh, I can't do it! I can't do it! Let me deal with him! Let me kill him! Please, no, 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 no. Please, no, no. He turned his wife to a she goat. Because she heard him and Indeke discussing on how to bring in the deity. He's a power and authority. He turned everyone in this kingdom to slaves, worshipping you as their gods. You made laws and implement them yourself. Which one of them is that no maiden will ever get married to a man from another kingdom? But his daughter is about getting married to a man from another kingdom. He sent the prince on exile so that he will not rise up and search for solution to this kingdom's problem. Hey! And your highness will not do anything about it. But thank the gods, the prince is on his way back. Hey! Thank the gods, my son is coming back. Yes! yes. Your highness, this too must be banished from this kingdom. Yes! yes. Hey, uh, 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 your maiden, please, I want to know, who are you? And uh, why are you helping us like this? Yes. Hey! I am Omame, the daughter of the late Asama, whom this man and Ideke conspired and killed. The forthcoming Kamala Festival, I think it will be great. Are you just thinking? I know it is going to be great because all the maidens selected to dance has been practicing to put their best on that day. Wow. Hey! <laughs> How I wish to be part of the maidens that we display. You were wishing without making it open, knowing fully well that it's for all the maidens in this kingdom. My dear, it is not for all the maidens. It was specifically selected based on age group. I disagree with you, Chika. It's for all the maidens. And your performance determines who we dance on the last day. I never knew it was for all the maidens. I would have joined, for I knew I would scale through. Sorry. Sorry, eh? And who is that? Oh, my man. Okay. <laughs> Why would the gods allow this happen to me? Why? No amount of tears will bring her back. What am I living for? Is it not better that I die? Uche, you can't die. You no, no, it's not Where are you going? What am I living for? No, 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 no,
Calm down. No amount of tears will bring your sister back. The death of your sister is very painful, but you have to bear. Even in Carlos' house as I speak, they are with tears now for the death of their daughter who also died today. It's okay, calm down. Hmm? Calm down. No. She was struck dead by Omame. Huh? of late Agwara wine. Omame? Yes. It's happened before us. Omame. Oh, this is terrible. Does it mean she's dead too? It's okay. Hmm? It's okay, calm down. If I'm out of hiding, see me, I can see me. Hmm? We must pick her out. We'll see you today. Huh? It's okay, stop crying. And uh, who is that lady called on my Um. She is the daughter of the late Asama, the Abarawai, the one that committed a theft and was hanged. Oh yes, and after the death of her mother, she ran to her maternal village. And why is she back in this manner? That I cannot tell you. But we shall not fold our hands and uh, watch her break down this great kingdom. Besides, her mother was hanged as a result of her atrocity. Oh. Is there anything we did not do? Iwe, no. Did you hold the Buzila and Iko Bobo? Never heard you of What? Why is he killing us? Everything was followed according to custom. Yes, we followed the custom accordingly. Why Bobo want money, Pikun? And why is Oro not here? What is that? No. We're chasing you. It's not good. I'm away from you. What is ghost? No. If you move them where you are, how do you know it's a ghost? No, we're to the market. It's so ghost. We're to the market. Some villagers, the villager, they run into us. And we are trying to find out what is after them. Igwe, a man made a pied and struck one of them dead. Yes, Igwe, yes. Yes, yes. A man made a pied and struck one of Ah, ah, ah. Are you sure? You saw a man? Yes, we saw her. I think we can win a little more. We saw her. We saw her. And you people say she's a, a young girl. How can she be so, so powerful like this? Hi. Um, go and call her some more for me. Okay. Then it will come here immediately. So you people saw a man there? Yes, it's where we saw her! Hi! <laughs> into us while we were going to the market. As one of them opened her mouth to tell us what was happening, she appeared as fuck her dead. We all hey. took to our roots. Hey! My dear, I don't need to be told again. Hmm. I have seen with my eyes. Hey! Hmm. I wonder how her parents will be feeling now. We have to be mindful of how we walk around this kingdom. We never can tell who is next. Hey! May the gods forbid. Hmm. It can never be my turn. Me too. Man, me. May the gods keep their watchful eyes over us all. Yes. Father, what is the cause of all this mysterious death in this kingdom? I know. How would I know? Well, the most important thing is that you can see I am digging deep every day. Find out what is causing the problem. Yes. Because since I was born till today, I have never seen such thing. I've never seen such thing. And now that we have seen it, 
do we now fold fold our arms and and watch our people disappear and die mysteriously nobody's folding hands my son nobody nobody's folding hands listen son this is spiritual and whatever that is spiritual will be followed spiritually you don't jump into things like that okay let me tell you something son since I lost your mother, I have been mourning her. And I want to ask you, have you ever seen me with any other woman? Because I've been mourning your mother, and I don't want to lose another. Please. But at the same time, I will involve her some more. Father, you have spoken well. But I think something has to be done, and fast. Yes, something has to be done and fast, no problem. Yes, but my son, I want you to calm down. From the war between me and this kingdom. Else, you bear the consequences. I'm sure you know what I mean. You will pay with your life. Do not threaten me, you little maiden. I am the mouthpiece and I of the gods of this kingdom. I request to know why you are killing them. Not now. But stay away. Hmm. Your Highness. Eh? This is not good. Uh, what is that? This is not good. What are you doing here? You better leave and never look into this matter again. Else you bear the consequence. And some more. Are you okay? What is happening? Your Highness. Where are you going to? Your Highness. You can tell the Lieutenant. There's a more. You can tell the Lieutenant. That's why you are here. That's why you are here. There's a more. Come here. 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 Something is definitely wrong somewhere. Yes. Where's a more to live without solution? Mm. Maybe I suggest something bigger than him has come over him. The way he was looking toward that direction, I think something bigger than him came, came over him. But there was nothing there. We're not here. We're all anything. here. I didn't see anything. Then he looks and if I can take, but we'll tell him Hi. What kind of problem is this? I, in fact, I, I don't care. I called him to do this. He came for this and he must finish it. Yes, Father. He, he must. must finish it. He must. But, 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 Your Highness, if you ask me, I think we should find another means of solving this problem. Yes. Yes, Your Highness. Yes. Uh, Let's look for another idea. <laughs>
okwa na ekwu na oye ezuru oke asi onye dalibi ya tuku afo we were all set with his highness um, to hear from Ezemmo. He started behaving strange. All of a sudden, he stood up, packed his properties, was about to leave without saying anything to us. And the king asked him what he was doing. The only thing he muttered was, if I can't that there is trouble. What's the meaning of that? Nobody knows, but I think he saw something that is bigger than him. That means there's no solution. <sighs> he didn't say anything to us. No solution. We're still in trouble. Big trouble. Carefulness is of utmost importance now. And nobody should leave their house except for something very important. Hey! Oh. So what are you going to do? struggle. What do you want Your Highness, I greet you. No, I did not see you in the meeting. Why? I'm very sorry, Your Highness. I was in a deep shock about our people that died recently. And that was why I quickly came to know the outcome of the meeting. So how did it go? Oh, uh, actually we invited our own example. He came and left us without saying anything. He left without saying anything? Exactly. I, 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 I couldn't believe what I saw. As the more came, he sat down, started uh, doing the uh, incantation and all that. And we were expecting something better to come out of him. All of a sudden, he stood up, started packing his back. We asked him, Ezemo, what is the problem? He said that uh, he said that something bigger than the ant because the ant child. Oh no, walk anger. You see, no, no, you see, Nago. That is. That is it. Exactly. Uh, Your Highness. I have to come in here. We will invite Ezenwai Iteke in this matter. She will be in a better position to know which way to follow. Ah! Your Highness, we are the youth representatives of this kingdom. We have come because of the unnecessary death that has been happening in this kingdom. We have come to seek your permission to go into this and find a lasting solution to it. Oh, the use of our land. I am so delighted to see this kind of wise and brave approach. I am so happy and I'm proud of you. I am so happy and proud of you. And I want you all to know that you have a king that I've never slept since this calamity started happening in this kingdom. And I want to promise you that I am doing everything possible to bring this calamity to an end. Okay? Yes, you have heard my father, the king. I am not sleeping over this matter either. And I will not give my eyes to sleep 
until this calamity is utterly erased. Yes. So, my fellow youths, go back to your respective homes and expect peace as it has been in this kingdom. Thank you, Your Highness. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, our prince. Thank, Thank you, your you Highness. prince. And may the gods of our land guide you. He said. Thank you, my prince. Thank you, your Highness. He said, I am so happy to see this kind of thing. That shows that even our youth. Hum! Above me, the cancer. Above me, the cancer. I can't run everybody with it. I'm not going to know, Mamma, that dead are all the way. Hum! I hear the voice of happiness. Hey, hey! 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 I hear the voice of victory and triumph. Are you my man? Yeah. <laughs> you say no, no. You say now go. I am over the